find it challenging to maintain a healthy lifestyle and not gain weight over the holidays. So I'm here to give you a couple tips on how to avoid it and maybe how to do a little bit of damage control if it does happen. This exercise is called lateral raises. You're going to take two dumbbells of the same size, maybe about two to five pounds. You're going to lift it up for two seconds, hold for a second, and bring it back down. If you don't have dumbbells at home, you can use something like cans of soup or anything that's two of the same size instead. And you're going to do about 12 reps. This exercise is a squat with bicep curl. All you're going to do is squat into a chair as if you were going to sit into it. And as you do that, you're going to lift up those dumbbells to do a bicep curl. It's okay if you end up kind of plopping into the chair. As you get stronger, you're going to be able to control it down and up. Make sure that you keep your feet about hip width apart and that your knees don't come past your toes. You're going to do about 12 reps and then move on to your next exercise. This exercise is called tricep dips. You're going to come onto a chair and bring your body out, hands flat on the chair behind you. You're going to lower your arms down so they come down to a 90 degree angle and then push back up using your arms. You can keep your legs bent. This is the most simple way to do it. If that's a little bit easy, there's a couple other ways to make it harder. You can bring one leg straight and up ahead of you, do half the reps that way and half the reps this way. Or you can also make it really difficult by keeping your legs straight, bringing it down and up. You're going to do 12 reps and then move on to your next exercise. Now we're going to do a plank. A lot of people are afraid of planks, but there's a couple ways of working into doing the most difficult type. The first way you can do it is you're going to bring your elbows down so that there's a 90 degree angle in your arm. You want your shoulder right over your elbow and you want a straight line from your shoulders down to your knees. So if this is too easy for you, then you can do the more challenging plank where you lift onto your feet, hold your belly button in and hold your body straight. Try to hold it for 20 seconds at first and then work up to a minute. This is one of my favorite holiday strategies to keep from eating something a little bit too naughty around the holidays. If you're invited to a party and you know that there's going to be a lot of high fat foods, tell the host or hostess that you already have dinner plans beforehand but that you'll be happy to join. Then beforehand, eat something healthy at home so that you're less likely to indulge in something that you may regret later. If you're a little bit nervous of only having rich high fat options at a holiday party, Think about bringing your own dish with you so that you know that you're going to have a healthy option available to you. I hope you enjoyed these tips and tricks and that you can make this a part of your everyday life. I also look forward to helping you reach your next exercise goals.